Okay, I don't know about you, but I don't like the idea of someone calling me boring. It's like someone saying your existence is only a waste of time, and all you're doing is wasting precious air on this small planet. For instance, I could be in a room with three other people for a group interview, and the interviewer can ask us what makes us interesting. One guy could say he spent his childhood learning ten languages and traveled across the world five times. As the other girl could say she spends her time volunteering across the city and knows how to perform surgery. And I'll sit there with zero ideas popping into my head because I can't think of a single idea that makes me interesting. So to make a few changes, I actually did travel across the world, learned a few interesting skills, and met a variety of people. I've been in situations that the average person hasn't really been in. Like walking through an African forest or dealing with pirates, and yet, even after all those events, if I was still placed in an interview with those same people, I'd probably still have a hard time saying anything interesting about myself. Which brings up the bigger question: What makes us more interesting? The first point is to be curious and seek out knowledge. We think about doing new things every day, whether it's trying a new type of food, playing an instrument, or stepping into a horror house. We always think about doing something new every day. Curiosity leads to the buildup of new experiences in the world and gives you a new point of view about things. If you have no free time to explore what's around you, use the time you have at work to see what's interesting. Even if you work at a fast food restaurant, you can use your time there to learn about how other people behave. In those type of environments, or the way the menu changes every week, just try to learn something new about your job every week. And if you do have time outside of work, pursue activities like reading books you never thought about before, or watch documentaries about different cultures. You see, by just taking the time to understand the way something works, you have the chance to talk about it with other people. And who wouldn't want a chance to talk about what they learned about in space, music, or another country? And the next point is to seek out new experiences. I know it sounds similar to the last topic, but it's not. Let me explain. The point of seeking out knowledge is to give yourself something interesting to say. But experiences are meant to do things that changes you and your perspectives about life. And it doesn't even have to be big. It can be small things like visiting a new restaurant or going to the movies. And if it's possible, do something crazy like taking a greyhound. Or train to a far-off location. The point is to get out of your comfort zone by visiting another country, or city, or town, and camp somewhere to get a taste of nature. I know these activities sound crazy, but put a schedule on your calendar for just one day out of the year to try something like that, because that's all it takes: one day out of the year to do something crazy that will give you a lifetime story. And the last point. Is to do something that's not common. There's nothing that makes people more interesting than doing something that the average person doesn't do. Take learning how to cook, for example. If you live in an environment where no one likes to cook or knows how to cook, the moment you tell others you like baking exotic foods will make other people more interested in you. And that's because you're doing something that's different. You're doing something they're not used to seeing every day. However, if you live somewhere where everyone likes to cook, It suddenly makes the idea of you cooking not so interesting anymore. Humans are drawn to those who do things differently than the rest, so take the time to look into hobbies that the average person doesn't do in your neighborhood. That way, you have something that makes you stand out. And it could be anything, such as painting, playing the piano, or hiking. Just make sure you like it enough so you'll want to talk about it with other people. Hey guys, hope you enjoyed. If you'd like to see more videos in the future. Be sure to hit that like button and subscribe.